Hello everyone and welcome back, it's Dawn here and today we're going to be making, or painting, a simple cat, perhaps sitting at the window and all we need is a bollard and a tennis ball. I know that sounds bonkers but you'll soon see what I mean. So this is our window, obviously we're going to paint it a lot smaller than this in our real paintings which I'll show you in just a few moments but this is a window, it's the same type of window that I've painted obviously a lot smaller but in a painting and I'll show you that in a minute and so we're going to paint our bollard first so there's our bollard there so that's our cat's body and obviously you'd fill that in but I won't fill it in as carefully as I would in a real painting this is just to give you an idea of what it's going to look like and then all we need is a tennis ball on the top like this like that And so we'll colour that in, or fill that in. And obviously because he's a cat, he needs... Actually, let's just bring that down a bit better than that. We can adjust the shape, that's no problem at all. And he needs some ears. So we'll give him some ears and they'll just be touching that top like that. But once you've put that... I know it doesn't look much like... It doesn't look much at the moment, but when you put that in a small painting, it really does look like a cat in a window. And I shall show you what I mean by that right now. Because here's the painting that I did. I actually painted this yesterday quite quickly. And I'm going to use, because it's so small, we're going to have it in this little window here. And because it's so small, we're going to do it dry into wet. Which means we're going to wet the area with our water first, just like that. And then while it's still good and wet, we're going to use a black pencil. And we're going to paint our cat in, but he's going to be a lot, lot smaller. Just like that. So there's our bollard shape. And we'll fill it in. And once this is wet, it's a lot easier to fill in smoothly. And then we just add a tennis ball on the top, like that. Just adjust the shape as you go. Give him some ears. Fiddle with the shape as you will. And there you have a cat sitting in the window. And if you wanted him laying down, all you need to do, we'll have perhaps, well, perhaps we'll have him laying out in the sun. All we need is a small loaf of bread, like that. Fill it in like that. And then put our tennis ball on the front, like that. Maybe a bit bigger. Give him a couple of ears and a tail. And you can just adjust that shape until you're happy with it. And there we have a cat sitting in a window and a cat laying out on the grass. And that's as easy as that. So I do hope you've enjoyed this little demonstration. And tomorrow there'll be one more demonstration of painting simple techniques for putting life into our paintings. And we will be doing a person walking off into the distance. It's not as difficult or as complicated as it might sound. So if you pop back tomorrow, you'll see how easy it is. It really, really is easy, I promise you. If I can do it, anyone can. So I hope you've enjoyed this. Please do stay safe and have fun with your paintings. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye till then.